Hello and welcome to the channel. If you haven't done so already, make sure to like and subscribe. Really appreciate that. Now, <laughs> let's talk about the new Mustang and the quality. Oh, we! How can somebody miss that? I, I think maybe that is why Ford doesn't want to give the UAW a new contract because maybe they're seeing them putting quality like this out. Why would any business give anybody more money if they're putting subpar product a uh, product but then again you know ford isn't really known for quality product themselves but this is really unacceptable it's two different seats and this isn't just the only example i have another one and how did nobody catch this nobody caught this and this is for sale you can see the window sticker right there at the dealership i mean come on i would have taken that car put it in the back hide it until I can get a new uh, seats, new Recaro seats to replace the one that it, that's in there. I wouldn't have put this thing out for nobody. I would be hiding it in the back if this was my dealership. But anyway, let's go ahead and um, and check out some more of these photos because there's, I think there's two vehicles, but I don't know how many they are that have this quality. All right, so here we are, 2024 Ford Mustang S650. How, how, how did nobody caught this? You can see it. The materials are completely different. This one is like all leather, right? And then this one's kind of like a cloth right there in the middle with the blue. I mean, they look nice, but how hard is it to just... How, anybody with, with eyes can see that these are two different seats. These are two fucking different seats. Nobody caught that. Not even at the dealership. Like I said, I would have hid this thing in the back and nobody would see it no customer would be able to take a picture of it and i'm not gonna lie the new mustangs look kind of sick um but look it's literally it's got the window sticker it's out in the public anybody can see it it can open the door take pictures of it no 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 i wouldn't have i wouldn't have i wouldn't have i wouldn't have flied if i was running the dealerships and here's another one too this is in the fucking showroom in the showroom <laughs> why i wouldn't have no 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 and this is a dark horse how can you fuck that up how can you fuck that up ford dark horse you can clearly see the seats are two different style face palm Oh, Jesus. Literally, you have two separate interiors here. Two different seats. This is beige with the with the black and this is blue with the um with the gray. Kind of like a super dark dark blue. At least that's what my eyes is telling me with the um with the gray over here. Why? Why? Is this why they can't get their contract? Because they can't make simple things like this? This is it's so easy. Anybody that walks up to it can easily notice like, hey, this does not match. Why doesn't this match? Or the general manager should have been notified. Somebody should have not been notified and put these fucking cars in the back so nobody would know anything about it. That's what I would have done. Like I said, I would have put these cars in the back Nobody can see it. Nobody can take pictures of it. It would be hidden until until we can order a new seat and replace that one with it. But this is just my opinion. But let me know in the comments below what you think about Ford's <laughs> quality. This is funny right here. Yes, this seat goof isn't the only Ford quality mess up we've come across recently. Other include a Ford Bronco wild track Sasquatch, which also had mismatched seats. So it's a thing. It's a pattern. It's a pattern. Maybe somebody's doing it deliberately. A Mustang EcoBoost convertible that had a plain Mustang seal seal insert on the driver's side and a dark horse on one, one of the passenger seal. You can check them out. Oh, shit. I guess it wasn't a dark horse. <laughs> I didn't see that. I wasn't paying attention myself. Oh, we. Thank God I read the article. Look, it's got Mustang right here and dark horse on the other side, which this isn't the dark horse. My goodness. Oof. Oh my goodness. 
this is crazy. This is unacceptable. Maybe that's why they can't get that new contract because Ford's like, man, you guys doing shit work. You're not going to get paid for it. We're not going to give you more money if you keep doing shit works. But anyway, you guys let me know what you think about this whole situation. As always, make sure to like and subscribe. And I appreciate every single one of you guys for watching my content. Really do. And um, sorry for being MIA again. I'm back. And then we're going to crank out some videos today. So we're going to do as much as we can. Cover all the stories that we missed before. We're going to talk about everything. All right. So stay tuned. It's going to be a busy day for me and you because you're going to be watching these videos. All right. Have a good one.